Hey guys, so the wig today is from YS Wigs. I love this packaging. It's a lavender and gold drawstring silk bag. And the box is this, I don't know what shade blue, but it's it's blue <laughs> and gold um, engraving on it with the logo, website, email address, and their social medias. So first of course is the wig and you also get this card with a logo on the back as well and then it just gives you the information of the wig but I wish they put the hair type on this card as well because I couldn't really understand anything. Um, you also get this little pamphlet. It just has like basic instructions of how to take care of the wig, their coupons and you know stuff like that. And you also get a wig cap as well, a set of two wig caps. And I have all my stuffs <laughs> behind me that I'm gonna use to um, customize this wig. So I was a little happy about the lace because this time it's not a super duper light lace that I'm gonna have to like tint so that it can match my skin tone. It's not a complete match but it's workable I guess. So this is what the inside of the wig looks like. You get a really nice parting space. The length is 12 inches. It's 130% density and the hairline is pre-plucked. But the hairline is still really nice though. And it has a clip and a lace in the back. So if you want to glue the back of the lace. Here I'm just testing how much it sheds. And I only got about, it's about four strands of hair out of this wig. Not much. So to apply this wig, since I'm not going to like wear it for too long, I'm using this super hard gel. It's clear and it dries clear, duh. <laughs> and I'm just going to push all my edges back. It's time we stop seeing baby hairs. It's not baby hairs, it's edges or I don't know. Hey, if it's baby hairs, it's baby hairs, whatever. The, the little tiny hairs in the front. So I'm using this weaving cap to um, cover my hair mostly because I just need everything to like lay flat and I don't want to use the super light wig caps because I'm gonna have to like use foundation on it and I hate doing that so so as you guys can see it's still too light for my skin tone but I'm gonna still make it work you know So I always recommend using a big brush like this to brush out your wigs or a big comb. Never just go straight for rat tail combs. So after applying the gel a second time, I'm just trying to stick this lace wig down. Um, I was having a little bit of of a trouble with it I don't know why but I worked it out all I had to do was just you know set it how I wanted it to be and this this glue this glue this gel isn't that strong so I just I just went in with a scarf to hold everything in place for a couple of hours so after that's done, it doesn't look that bad. 
like I still had some pieces to glue down in the front but it's not bad at all so of course after the glue dries you're gonna have like some little residue and um, it was a little too long so I cut a little piece off on both sides and glued it down and here I'm just doing some baby hairs if you don't want to you don't have to y'all let me know in the comment section do you do you call it baby hairs or do you call it edges team baby hair or team edges which one <laughs> which one because this is a legit argument So if the rat tail comb doesn't work for you, you can use um, one of your makeup brushes, you know, what you use for your eyebrows, like this little brush right here, I forgot what it's called. Or you can use a spoolie, the spoolie works just as good. So this is what it's looking like so far. It's looking very natural and I'm happy with it to be honest. It's not too too crazy, you know, you know. So right now I'm just trying to straighten the hair. I'm gonna go in small sections and just straighten the hair. <laughs> she cute she cute and whatever looking like someone's teenage daughter like hi i'm in high school i'm a senior in high school mm -hmm. why do i feel like every senior in high school have like a bob like if they have relaxed hair they have like a bob is it just me or is it college students which one So some hairs were sticking up so I decided to grab some hairspray to you know let them lay flat. Um, my battery died after this which is why I did it in slow-mo. Yeah that was it for this video. Everything you need to know about this hair will be in the description down below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!